Hey guys, welcome back to The Merge, the wrestling guide for jiu-jitsu, powered by Fuji Sports. Third Coast Grappling, Kumite 5, Hanato Kanuto versus Tai Rotolo. Every time I see Tai step on a mat, this guy's wrestling is getting better and better. Uh, these two are, are in an over-under, and Hanato has his hands clasped behind Tai's back. Tai takes a big step with his lead leg, hits this inside trip. Uh, just a few things about the inside trip from here. Uh, when I go for an inside trip, or as you can see in this, uh, in this highlight here, it's the same side as the overhook that Ty has. Now when he steps this leg in, it's, uh, it's inserting and wrapping around uh, Hanato's leg from here, but it's not kicking out this leg, right? I'm gonna go into how it's more of a lean from here, but I'm not trying to like sweep and kick his leg out this way and lift it off the ground. I'm just simply vining around his leg, typically below the knee. It can go as far down to the ankle, depending on how long you keep this overhook. Last thing, when I step in, it's a heavy lean to the side because I'm taking away this leg post and I'm taking away this arm post. All right, so there's two options I'm gonna show right now with the inside trip. Uh, the first one is the one I just showed, right? We're gonna step our leg through and we're essentially dropping down to a double leg position, covering the legs. And I personally like this one the best just because uh, it's extra security. If for some reason he scrambles out or he's able to uh, wiggle this leg out or let's just say you don't do it efficiently, you're still in a great double leg position. So as I take my little shuffle step, bring this through here, see my, I basically let go of the overhook up here. So my knee's able to hit the ground. And as I lean this way, it's opening up his knee line. Doing this normal speed, one more time, dropping down to the double leg from here. So quick shuffle step, crow hop, dropping down, getting your two points. The other option is if we're gonna stay in an overhook position, we're gonna keep that overhook and take our shovel step, bring that leg inside, and we're just gonna lean our weight to our left at this point, and we're just gonna bring our opponent down. As you can see, the knee is not gonna be close to the ground because I'm keeping my upper body close to his upper body with that overhook. All right, so when Ty hit this, uh, Hanato's leg wasn't you know, as close as we would like it to be, but Ty did a great job on really making up for that extra distance with his leg. He took a huge step forward, his left arm reached, uh, and really made up for that distance. But to make things easier, all we have to do is circle our opponent so he steps with the same side I have the overhook our, uh, leg. So look, we're here, he steps, now I gotta take that shovel step, bring it through. And look, as we're here one more time, we're gonna go down to the double leg. Our hands are covering the legs, leaning to the outside, opening that knee line up, right? As you get more mileage on this, uh, this can even be something you hit from space. So we can be in a good stance from here and we just take a quick shuffle step and hit the inside trip from there as well. Thanks for tuning in today. Head over to themergeonline.com, subscribe for free, and I'll see you guys next week.